What is up, everybody? It's Photoshop Reggie, back again with another Photoshop video. It's been a while since I've done this, but I'm ready, and I'm back. I sent out a tweet asking you guys, what are your Photoshop requests? You guys replied, let's freaking get it. But first, I opened up a PO box. Address will be right here. So send me some garbage that I can open. Make sure to subscribe and like this video. Let's try to get some likes. Also, thank you to everyone who showed up to VidCon to say what up. It was great meeting all of you. But you guys have requests, and I'm going to Photoshop them. Let's freaking do it. Our first request is from Tanner. She just simply says, do whatever. So you want to put all this on me. Well, how am I supposed to freaking think when your entire room is a mess? So first of all, we're just going to go through, clean up all this garbage. You got shit just stacked all over the place. Hoodie's not even hanging right. Oh my God, it's a whole ass mess. This actually just offended me so much that you just lost your eyebrow privileges. See you next year, buddy. Meg wants to be Pinocchio. Why do you want to be Pinocchio? I don't actually know, but let's give it a go. Okay, so we're just right here. First of all, we're gonna select this nose just a bit. And now let's just think, maybe you just told a fat lie. Like, uh, you shouldn't subscribe to Reggie Weber right now. Oh, look at that shit going. Oh my god, no, that looks bad. Okay, that was like a fucking shoe. If Pinocchio tells the truth, does his nose get shorter? Or is it just like forever long based off the lies that he tells? Okay, well, now we're just gonna give you a little baby nose. Kind of looks like a little thumb. Good luck sniffing now, dude. Mer, mire, mirror, mirror, mirror on the wall. Make it look like I got some sleep. All. Sure, buddy. But here's the thing, buddy. Dog, dude, uh, it's very light in your room. You're not even on your bed. You're standing straight up. I don't know how you're gonna fall asleep like that. Let's help you out. Ow. So first of all, we're just gonna select you. We're gonna get you a nice brand new bed. Get you tucked in. Perfect. Now, I'm not gonna be able to put your phone away, but uh, maybe you just sleep better like that. Also, now that the angle's different, it looks like you have a giant hand and a giant phone, but you know, it's okay, it's all right. But next thing, obviously, we just gotta close your eyes, start counting some sheep, and then I'm just gonna go ahead and kill the lights for you. Maybe people won't realize how freakishly big your hands are. Next, Mary says, make me into a clown, please. I've been feeling like one after taking all these frick boys back. If you're taking all these frick boys back, then you're definitely a clown dude. Okay, let me go ahead and uh, make that official. In classic clown fashion, we gotta paint the face white. We give you the nice dead looking skin tone. We gotta make you look extra happy. I'm really bad at face paint, just bear with me. And of course, the finishing touch. And guess what, buddy? You're officially a clown. Maybe now you won't take back those frick boys. Or maybe they just won't be interested because you're wearing full clown makeup. Either way, I think that's a win. Why the shit are clowns getting so popular again? In 2016, people are literally dressing up as clowns and like chasing people around the street. So I kind of guess that this is a slight improvement. Holy shit. I think we just might have uncovered a conspiracy theory. So in 2016, the movie It was about to be released. So then clowns are taking the streets, whatever, that's going crazy. And now being a clown as a joke is becoming popular about the same time It 2 is starting to come out. And Dustin says, surprise me. Another one where it's just all up to me to figure out what you want. Well, I like the merch, Dustin. We're gonna go ahead and give you a big surprise. But you're not really selling it to me with your surprise face. So we're gonna have to go in and fix all that. Nothing says surprise like some big old wide eyes. And what's that? I sniff a birthday cake. It's your lucky day because we got one right here. Now go ahead and blow out those candles. Happy birthday, Dustin. It's time to go out, hit the road, and maybe your neighbor's dog. That was one f***ing time, Jerry. Make a wish. Sharpie says, can you make me taller? Yeah, I could probably do that. I'm seeing that your bag is empty. That might be because you can't reach the little handle. So yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. What I'm gonna do is select you. I'm gonna take you and I'm gonna make a whole f***ing army of people. But there's one problem. Everyone in your army is still too short to reach the handle. So we're gonna merge them together. And now we've officially created a taller version of you. Lindsay says, do whatever you want with this photo. Make it more interesting. How can I make this more interesting? So what I'm seeing right now is you know your typical 4th of July sparklers, you know, nothing too gripping here. So what we can do is maybe it would be more interesting if you were lighting, you know, a nuclear bomb that'll start World War III. That might get some likes on Instagram. But either way, you'll definitely have the biggest firework on the block. Larry says, can you make my cat look less terrifying? Yeah, it's pretty terrifying. I hope your cat doesn't just sit like that all the time like trying to catch flies in its mouth like this gross cat teeth. But if we just get rid of the mouth altogether, you'll see it's a lot less scary already. Or, you know, if that's a little bit unethical, why don't you just like throw something in there like a kazoo? Nickel says, make me look like I'm part of a biker gang. You already do low key kind of look like you're part of a biker gang, but you're not even with your squad, which is kind of sad. So let's call up the boys and get you back on the road. That honestly fits right in. You look just like the other guys. This looks like me and the boys heading to Area 51. Safe travels, buddy. Brett says, make me look like I'm on the beach on a sunny day. Well, unfortunately, you're in the back seat, so I can't take you to the beach, but what I can do is bring the beach 
to you. What a beautiful view. Have a great time. Make sure you don't step on one of those spiky things and you, then you have to, you know, like piss all over your feet to make it the, the sting go away. How does... I'm not sure how that works. And I'm starting to think that that dude just wanted to piss on my feet. Hmm. Derek says, put my hair like the top of the tree. I literally don't know one single bit what you meant by that. But if you want your hair to be closer to the tree, like if you're trying to fish out a fucking cat with your forehead, then I don't know, I could give you like a bigger forehead. You know what, I'll make you a deal. I'll make it even bigger. Happy tree heading. And the next one is gonna, wait, you know what? I'm actually gonna go back to that last girl and just because you said that all so weird, I'm just gonna go ahead and give you dog teeth. I don't know why, but it's done. Riley wants a horn, bet. Um, okay, so I just did that whole thing and I realized she said a unicorn horn, which makes literally a million times more sense, but I think I might have just created the world's superhero. You just squeeze really hard and you just get And I don't know if it would do anything to the enemies, but I mean it's kind of cool. Not all superpowers have to like blow up an entire city. Cat says make it look like I'm on a safari. Look at her out there in the wilderness. She has no survival gear. She has no safari hat. Kind of look like an amateur, bro. Oh no. What is that? I think that's a tiger. And a sea bear circle is not gonna save you from that one. Oh no, he's doing his uh, lion expansion where you know what they do before they eat people. And then they jump up in the air and freeze there and then drink you and then go back to the normal orientation. And then now he's full and walked away. Should've worn a helmet. Alex six, 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 six. says, can you edit my face into the master meme man? Probably, I don't know, let's find out. Okay, you know what? That actually didn't look too horrible. Kind of proud of that. Siamese wants to be on the moon, pointing to Earth. Okay, buddy. So now we got you on the moon, and you're pointing at that beautiful view of our amazing planet. Oh, shit, I forgot to give you oxygen. Oh, well, you're on the moon. It's not my problem. Ashley, my dude, says, Yo, Reggie, can you make it look like we're in a sick place? Yeah, that place is like the opposite of sick. What are you in, like an Arby's parking lot? But yeah, if your squad wants to be somewhere super dope, oh, no, you said super sick, then who am I to say no? I'm gonna put you guys in front of the sickest place on the planet. Hope you have health insurance. Alista says, Can you make me taller? I'm literally only like four feet tall sure but here's the thing dude I already made somebody taller this was in the rules I'm out of like longer limbs the only way I could make you taller I think now is if we just expand your forehead a little bit That doesn't look too bad. Samson says, turn me into a chicken. Okay. He didn't specify on like the type of chicken, if it's alive or not. Well, I'm just gonna have to go ahead and give it a try. This looks like a secret nightmare experiment conducted by McDonald's where they tried to make like a perfect human chicken nugget hybrid. But I mean, it's kind of cool. Mice has always wanted to be a penguin. I don't even know what a penguin's face looks like. I know that they're like, the, you know, white and black. I don't know, maybe if I just like squeeze your face around a lot. No, okay, you know what? I can't make a penguin. I'm just gonna delete your eyebrows. JJ wants to look like this emoji. That's actually my favorite emoji ever. So let's give it a try. Nailed it. The last one comes from Michael's Dead Coles. He wants to be a Viking. Easy.
You know what? That actually doesn't look too bad. That's probably the best of my day. That is gonna be it for today's video. Make sure to like and subscribe. My PO Box address is in the description, so make sure to send me some stuff for my next series. The shout out this week is gonna be Giovanna. Thanks for watching, Giovanna. If you wanna be next week's shout out, tweet me, leave a comment, tweet hashtag Reggie make me shout out, and I'll see if I can make it happen. But other than that, I will see you guys next week. Peace.